And I hope this time it filmed properly. I really hope so. Oh my god. Yeah, guys, stay tuned. Who the fuck still says stay tuned? Please keep watching my videos if you want to. If you don't want to, that's fine. But yeah, guys, thank you so much. Thank you. Ba, 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 ba. Welcome back to my channel guys, thank you so much for coming back. I know it's been a while but I've been lazy. I'm not even gonna lie to you and be like, oh I've been busy, I've been busy, no. <laughs> I've been lazy, all right, yeah. But I'm back and I did promise you guys a Q&A part two, but, but, this time I didn't write it down, which is so dumb of me. Which is so dumb of me, but I remember like a few questions, like a few, cause yeah, I was like, <laughs> The fuck? I'm joking. I was just like, okay, cool, cool. and I hope you guys can see my face. I don't know, cause uh, yeah. But I remember a friend of mine asked me a question. Her name, I don't know. Yeah, I'm not gonna say her name in case she doesn't want me to say her name. But it's a close friend of mine. She asked, how long does it take for me to fully? How long does it take for me to fully transition? And I think. Um, in my Q and A part one, I kind of talked about that a bit, but I wasn't really. It wasn't the same question, if you get me. So, how long does it take for me to fully transition? As I had said before, it's all up to me. If I want to stop, I can stop. If I want to continue, I can continue. Depends on how things are changing and how, yeah. Depends on how things are changing. If I'm happy with what I have now, I can stop. But there's a chance that the periods will come back. Especially, as I said before, if I haven't removed the woman parts or the woman parts down there or in my tummy, the uterus and all that ish, it will come back and I don't want that. So, no. Um, yeah, it, it differs. It differs. If you want to stop, you can stop. If you don't want to, you don't have to stop. It's okay. It is oh, 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 okay. And another question someone asked me was, um, surgery at the bottom. Is it, like, is it easy? Thing is, there's like different types of surgeries for the bottom area. There's a lot, there's a lot. I don't want to say them because I don't know how to pronounce them properly. <laughs> but, but there's um, one surgery where they take skin graft of your arm and your thigh and they form the things. And yeah, and like guys, I don't want to get too technical because I feel like I want to be telling you guys the wrong things and it's funny because I've researched and I've seen videos of people talking about it, people who have done it and whatnot, but I'm just so afraid that I'm going to flop. So I don't want to like tell you guys the wrong ish. So yeah, but yeah, there's that option where you can take from your skin, your arm or your thigh, excuse me. And there's an option in which, as you know, when you're on um, hormones, testosterone or whatever, your clit enlarges right cool it enlarges so you could either just from then on they just insert um scrotum balls whatever oh my god sounds so weird yeah um that and then they can just um work from your clit and just form a phallus yeah a little phallus like yeah so there's like many ways some of them take from your back um, yeah, those are the three procedures that I know that I've actually researched and like compared which one is better and whatnot and whatnot. So yeah, you, it's not simple. It is not simple at all. Like it takes a lot and it's, 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 it's a lot. It comes in different stages. Cause I mean, you're going to have to remove the womb, the uterus and all that before you do the things. Cause I mean, imagine having your period while you don't have the woman genitals anymore it's gonna be like oh my god the blood is stuck you have to drain you so rather not rather not it's very it's very complex it's not like as simple as just going to the surgeon and be like okay cool i want a dick can you do that for me and be like yeah, yeah sure come here da, 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 done like it comes in a lot of stages guys and like a lot and a lot of stages like three if I'm not mistaken, there could be more, depending on how you heal and how things go and if you need more surgery because maybe something went wrong or whatever, whatever, whatever. So it differs. It 
um yeah oh my gosh my memory is shit if you know me you know that my memory is rubbish oh by the way i am seeing my doctor on monday the 16th of october it's a new doctor i'm seeing because i moved from Cape Town, so now i have to see another one so yeah i'm seeing him on monday the 16th and um i don't know i don't know what to expect i really don't i'm not gonna be like i'll get there and he'll be like okay yeah take your hormones be done now i really don't know what to expect he has to know me better as a person speak and whatnot blood samples blah 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 since i've been taking iron pills because my iron was lacking and my vitamin d as well that is almost finished and i finished my face medication and stuff so yeah we'll just take it from there. Hey, my gosh this is the second take but anyway i'm um, sorry guys i had to quickly check on whatsapp for people who did ask me questions because i deleted my snapchat my instagram and my youtube because i was out of space yeah so i don't know why i never jot down things because i know i know that my memory shit but i always tell myself that yeah I'll, I'll remember i'll remember but if i didn't answer your question just private message me and i'll tell you like i'll answer you i'll tell you anything you want to know i'm okay but i just read a thingy Oh, wow a question now on whatsapp and someone was like would i tell my partner that i am transgender and the answer is of course i would like why wouldn't i why would i not tell them that i am transgender because imagine when okay boom i come and i'm like oh pashash and i look good ooh 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 and then things are happening and one thing leads to another we get there and then she's like fuck okay. what the fuck Imagine how awkward that would be. So I think it's a must for me to tell them so they know what to expect and know what to um, look, not look forward to. What the fuck? Know what to expect. That's, that's, yeah, I said it. Know what to expect. But yeah, but when it comes to the dating scene, guys, I'm not ready. <laughs> I don't want to date yet. I'm not ready. It's all too much for me. Uh, it just gives me stress. It gives me so much stress. And also because I don't want to be a burden. That's the one thing. I don't want to be a burden. And I know that like, with this whole journey and process it's going to take a long fucking time and i just want to deal with it by myself i don't want to be a burden to some girl shame when she's like oh what do you need what do you need and i have dysphoria which is when i feel shit about myself and i just feel like absolute cuck and i just feel awful i don't want her to be like oh you'll be okay everything is okay no 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 tap out i want to feel shit and feel shit knowing that it's fine i have myself to pick up i have to pick up myself and i'll be good i don't want to be a burden and the girl's like oh no do you need this do you need that do you need nah it's fine i can fend for myself i'll be good let me focus on myself get to where i want to be be happy be comfortable with myself know that i'm happy and i feel great and i feel amazing and then we can start talking about dating but for now i am okay i am good the, i mean there is someone i'm vibing with reviving but we're not dating because i don't want to date i it's too much for me like i don't want to burden anyone with my problems and whatnot so rather not but yeah i would tell my partner like i would that that's the fir not the first thing but one of the many first things i'll tell them that hey listen this is what's popping because i mean it's out of respect i can't just ambush someone and then at the end i'm like yeah yeah <laughs> i am you know what i mean when things are awkward and i'm like oh yeah i forgot to tell you <laughs> uh it will be so awkward so rather i just tell them from the beginning that listen this is what's popping if you don't want to be with me it's chill to understand before we even get too attached to each other or whatever let me just let you know from the beginning that's what's popping because i i mean i don't want to force anyone into a relationship where i didn't tell them and then at the end they're like oh i didn't know no because i didn't know i can't be with you and i can't just be like yeah fuck you're gonna be with me because you said you love me despite anything so what the fuck does this mean nah let me tell you from the beginning if you want to be with me be with me if you don't don't it is what it is right yes but yeah i will tell my partner like it's a must guys my memory is shit and if you know me you do know that so i i, I have no idea why i didn't jot down or screenshots or anything because now all my apps are gone i only have whatsapp <sighs> So as I said before, if you do have a, um, a question for me, I will just private message me, we'll talk and we'll be good. If you have my number, I don't mind. Yeah, even if, as I said before, it's a dumb ass motherfucking question, we'll talk there. I'm not going to post. 
I'm not gonna post another Q&A. We've had enough Q&As. Or else my thing would just be like Q&A, 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 Q&A. No, that's enough for, yeah. Two is enough, two is enough. We good? Yeah. The only Q&As I'll ever, ever have in my whole entire life is when I've actually started on T and I can see the changes and you wanna ask how I feel or how is this, how is this? Then I'll have a Q&A, but for now, no, it's enough. <laughs> that's enough and yeah guys thank you so much for watching i know this video wasn't as juicy and as meaty as you wanted it to be but as you can see i'm not a meaty person myself so uh, i can't deliver something i don't have <laughs> damn but yeah guys thank you so much for watching thank you thank you if you are subscribed i can't thank you enough i literally can't thank you enough thank you please pass it on share comment subscribe if you haven't like if you want to if you liked it if you didn't okay it's fine don't like it's fine I don't wish it but pass it on tell people that they should watch me not because i am awesome but because i am teaching the youth and any other person who wants to learn but yeah yes thank you so much guys <laughs>